back home. Sat on the city, relaxing. And it's only now, as I'm looking at the video, that I realise somehow I changed the aspect ratio. So I've shot it in narrow vision. Still going to upload it, but yeah, it's kind of ruined. Well, I made it two thirds of the way up the rapids at Britain, but they were just too powerful for me. So now I have to turn around, just leisurely drifting back down to where I started. So, 
yeah it's a nice little short paddle nice workout obviously i'm building up my paddling technique of power so and maybe next time i'll get over them rapids but you know i say i don't think there'll be much more paddling this now as we head into the winter come the spring there'll be less water on it anyway yeah for now it's just a two, three mile drift. This is probably the calmest bit now. It speeds up again once we round that bend down there. literally probably only half a mile from the centre of Hereford it looks so picturesque yeah. as you can see we're spinning see that on the video how is he playing I'm not sure that's going before my wife goes to work. See her off. Last time I come down here, I saw that footpath and I didn't know where it went. I still don't know where it went. But now there's a boat there. It's a street sign, so it's not. It's just a random launch.
cam on again because let's see if we can get closer to this boy. I mean, I upset him earlier. Let me get really close. If you look over there, the heron in the tree. Let's see if I can drift right up to him. I hope you can see it on this little clip of the camera. Don't even think he's seen me yet. Well, there we go. There we go. <laughs> yep. That's the second time I've peed him off him on paddle. Try not to mess this one up. It's not so much going through that's a problem, it's when I get out the other side. And I don't want to get called, pulled into one of those eddies. Gotta be careful because if you hit the, the eddy line. It can capsize you. Eddie to the left, look, look at that eddy line. Look at the swirls there. Uh, last time I hit that, they look, look at my boat spinning, is it? It's the eddy line. And again. Can't believe somebody's actually bought that and thinks they're gonna uh, restore it. Look at the state of it. It doesn't even float, normally when a river floods, it just gets like swamped. Right, so we've passed through Hereford. Still in Hereford, but 
That was the centre of Hereford. That's the King James's playing field that we're passing along now. And my finishing destination is just round the corner. Oh, Cormoran. Definitely not going to let me get as close as the other guy did. Just be able to see the footbridge now coming into sight. My shoulders were hurting. This was the very first bit I did. Birds are getting really annoyed with me, look. It's flown all the way down here. He's actually going where I'm landing. Look at the current on this. None of my arms are killing. This is where I started. Upstream here. Oh god, my landing spot's been invaded by stuff. Oh, look at that. I don't know what the hell they are. Some sort of weird looking duck. Right. This is my landing spot, people. Oh, num bum. Num bum. Num bum. Oh. oh, and there we are. Back on dry land now for a short walk across the home. I'm all done. Right, just giving the bank a quick check, make sure I haven't left any in it. There's nothing worse than walking home and realising you've missed something. 
<laughs> I am ready for my quick yomp across the meadows. Would you believe that little trolley only cost me four quid or four fifty? That's my kayak, my paddles, everything else replaceable. Hey, off we go.